Hey guys, how's it going? Um, this is a quick video that uh, I'm going to be showing basically what I played in the month of January of 2013 both on my Wii U and the uh, Nintendo 3DS and the reason I'm doing this is because both the uh, Nintendo Wii U and Nintendo 3DS they track down the uh, game, you know, the uh, playtime of whatever, you know, game you play during that uh, month so Think of this as a uh, what I've been playing recent, uh, recently type of video. I know a lot of YouTubers in the uh, gaming community, they do videos like that. So think of this uh, activity log update or January update as what I've been playing recently. So um, obviously I can't do this for the PS3 or the Vita because they don't have an activity log. So it's really hard to estimate. But anyways, let's get started. And the uh, number one game for the month of January was New Super Mario Bros. U. I put 12 hours in that month. And those 12 hours that you see right there um, were the hours that I needed to 100 <clears throat> complete the game 100%. Um, that is finding all the secret exits and finding all three golden coins in each level. So super fun game highly recommend it i have a, a review video up if you guys want to check it out second place at 11 hours and 45 minutes we have trying to which um i did beat on uh during january but uh, i'm still playing the game because i'm trying to beat the uh, wii u exclusive exclusive levels that were added to the wii u version so i'm currently working on that if you guys want to do some co-op let me know then we have the internet browser, three hours and forty-one minutes. Sometimes before I before I go to bed, I find myself, you know, uh, browsing through the uh, internet. So it's uh, it works pretty well on the Wii U gamepad. Then we have Miiverse with two hours and ten minutes. It's always fun and entertaining, reading other people's comments and whatnot. So fifth place we have YouTube, two hours. Sixth place we have Zombie U. Two hours and one minute. I actually those 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 two hours account for you know the time that I needed to beat the game. Um, obviously, I played Zombie U through most of December, and uh, I beat the game in January. So th those two hours that I, that you see there are the uh, is the time that I needed to completely finish the game. Then we have Scribble Notes on Scribble Notes Unlimited at seventh place with one hour and fifty seven minutes. I'm fairly close on finishing that game. I'm I'm pretty close to the end right now. So, eighth place we have Balloon Fight, which is the first Wii U Virtual Console game that it's currently available for thirty cents. So, you can't go wrong buying a uh, NES Classic for thirty cents. And then on ninth place we have the Nintendo eShop. Half an hour, you know, I had to log in to download some demos and buy um, Balloon Fight. Then we have Nintendo TV, 10th place. Um, I think those 30 minutes account for when I was watching the uh, national championship game between Alabama and, and Notre Dame. In fact, if you take a look at the last Nintendo Direct where, you know, the uh, new X Xenoblade sequel game got announced, I'm, I'm being featured. Um, one of my comments for the national championship game is being featured. So check that out. And then we have NBA 2K13 demo. It's an alright game. Uh, the demo was pretty good, but I think I'm gonna wait until it drops down in price before I purchase that game. So those are my 11 titles or and applications that I played in the month of January. Now let's take a look at what the uh, 3DS activity log looks like for the month of Oh, this is February, so let's take a look at January 2013. There we go. You can see the stats there. And let's take a look at the play time. All right. And uh, let's do a page view. And there we go, we have, at first place, we have Fire, Fire Emblem, The Sacred Stones. Now, that's the Game Boy Advance game um, that I'm currently playing in anticipation to Fire Emblem Awakening for the 3DS, which I haven't bought yet, but probably will soon. 
so 6 hours and 14 minutes. Second place we have Gunman Clive, which I put a gameplay video up. This is a uh, shoot 'em up uh, classic game that resembles the old school Mega Man and Contra games. So, really fun game. Those 3 hours and 37 minutes that you see there um, were more than enough to beat the game three times. So, really fun game. Then, on third place, we have the demo for Fire Emblem Awakening for one, with 1 hour and 11 minutes. Fourth place, Kid Icarus Uprising. Even though I already beat the game, I you know I fire up that game every now and then just because it's so good. Then we have an internet browser, 33 minutes. We have New Super Mario Brothers. That's the uh, DS game. Play for 32 minutes. I was trying to I believe get some of the coins that I'm missing because I have not finished that game 100% yet. So then we have the Nintendo. Eshop, 14 minutes. Swap note. Um, every now and then I exchange notes with uh, people that are on my 3DS friend list. So then we have activity log, Street Pass, Me Plaza to exchange the puzzle pieces. Balloon Fight, which is you know the 3DS version. Super Mario 3D Land, only six minutes. Resident Evil Revelations, only five minutes. I was probably checking out the uh, street pass features that I or the items that I received from other people, so that's why I only played those for six and five minutes, respectively. Donkey Kong Jr. Um, for the NES, five minutes. Paper Air Airplane Chase, which is a very quick, short, and sweet game that was or originally released for the uh, DSi um, service, four minutes. Nintendo 3DS Sound, two minutes. Friend list, two minutes, notifications, two minutes. And Kirby and the Amazing Mirror for the Game Boy Advance, one minute. <laughs> I probably fired up the game and decided not to play it or something, but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I don't know, maybe I'm gonna do this uh, on a monthly basis. Ob obviously this covers my activity log for January 2013, so Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and if you want to leave a, a comment or if you want to share your activity log, please do so. I'm always very interested. Um, in fact, it's one of my favorite features of both the uh, Nintendo 3DS and the uh, Nintendo Wii U. I just love looking at the statistics and you know how how much um, play time uh, you know some a person can put into some of the games and new, uh, newer and older releases and whatnot. So. Anyways, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all next time.